What is up, everyone? Lost Memories here. Today I'll be making another video to my phone. Today I'll be playing Pokemon Emerald version. Let's not go through that opening scene once again. Please, can I skip it? Yes, I did skip it. Okay. Anyway, um, we're gonna be stepping into the Hoenn region. I think. Um, do not. Um, do not get mad at me if I'm wrong. Anyway, my frame. Please have purple. That's probable. I don't like that type of purple. Something go like you know, like the cloud thingy, because that looks really good. You know, really, really good and comfortable. Anyway, let's get into our new game. Again, I cannot wait to get into this. See what Pokemon we're gonna meet. Chris, third generation, though. Hi, sorry to keep you waiting. Welcome to the world of Pokemon. My name is Birch, but everyone calls me a Pokemon professor. This is what we call a Pokemon. Uh huh. This world is widely inhabited by creatures known as Pokemon. We humans live, live alongside Pokemon at times, at times friendly playmates and at times cooperative workmates. And sometimes we band together and battle others like us. But but despite our closeness, we don't know everything about Pokemon. In fact, there are many, many secret secrets surrounding Pokemon. To unravel Pokemon mysteries, I've been undertaking research. That's what I do. And you are? I am a boy. A boy or a girl. I really like the girl sprite, but I would have to say I am a girl. Got him! A boy. Alright, what's your name? My name has to be Shadden, because I, I you know just, just, just forget it. Shad. Uh, S. H. A. Uh, okay, yeah. D. E. Wait. I was clicking the wrong button. Okay, S. H. A. Where is it? Oh, D. E. Shadden. So it's Shadden. Yes, yeah, Shadden. You, your Shadden is living in the home route. Home route. Hometown of Little Root. I get it now. What type, of thing, what type of town is that? Alright! <laughs> Your very own adventure is about to unfold. Take courage and leap to the world of Pokemon where dreams and adventures fresh him to wait. Well, I'll be expecting you later. Come see me come see my Pokemon lab. Okay then. This is where we are um where are we right now? Like are we Oh we're in a truck? We are in a truck. And we're about to so we're, I guess we're moving right now. We're about to take our first first step into into the Hoenn region. To to where the world of creatures and Pokemon wait. Let's go. Shannon, <laughs> we're here, honey. It, it must be tired of writing. Oh, yeah, I'm not gonna be doing the voices. So did the voices be like, <laughs> it must be tired of writing with the things in the moving truck, and that sounds weird. So, it must, it must be tired of writing with our other things in the moving truck. Well, this is a literal town. How do you like it? This is our new home. It has it has a quaint feel, but it seems to be an easy place to live, don't you think? And you get your own room, Shadden. Let's go inside. Okay, why not? Why not, Mama? See, Shadden, isn't it nice in here too? The movies, the movies, Pokemon do all the work of moving and cleaning up after us. It's so convenient, Shadden. Your room is upstairs. Go check it out, dear. Dad bought you a new clock to mark our move here. Don't, don't forget to set it. I won't forget to set it. And look. Beautiful world of Pokemon awaits where these things carry our stuff for us because we're too un. I'm just gonna follow it. Yes, it's, it's, it's kind of hard to do. He moves too fast. Anyway, uh, let's go set the clock. Clocks have been started and set it. Uh, it doesn't matter why we set this because the emulator set it for us. So we are good. Shadden, how do you like your new room? Good. Everything's put away neatly. Then <laughs> they finished moving everything in downstairs too. Pokemon movers are so convenient. Oh. You should make sure that everything's all, all there on your desk. Um, I think it's talking about the potions that I need. Okay, what would you like to do with our item potions? That's actually going to come very in handy as we go along on our Pokemon journey. Oh, Shannon, Shannon, come quickly, come quickly. Look, it's Pedaboo Gym. Maybe Dad will be on. <coughs> we buy you this report from in front of Pedaboo Gym. Oh, I think that was on, but we missed him too bad. Oh yes, one of Dad's friends live in Little Root Town. <coughs> live in town, I meant. Professor Root. Birch. Bert. Really? Professor Birch is his name. Birch. He he lives right next door, so you should go try to go introduce yourself. Okay. So I don't know what she meant by next door because technically this will. Oh wait. Oh God. No, please go out. I don't want to be in the house. I want to go explore the world of Pokemon. We know we do not have our own Pokemon yet. Okay, this is Professor Birch's house. Wait, this house is supposed to be going in anyway, so let's go. So much dialogue. Oh, hello, and you are? Oh, you're shutting our next, our new next door neighbor. Hi. 
We have a daughter about the same age as you. Our daughter was so excited about making a new friend. Our daughter is upstairs, I think, okay? Fine, you're our daughter, your daughter, your daughter. Oh, Pokeball. I kinda really want this Pokemon. Maybe I should touch, maybe I touch. Oh, never mind. She caught me. She caught me. Huh? Who? Who are you? Oh, you're, you're Shadden. So you're moving with today? Um, I may. Glad to meet you. I. I have a dream of becoming friends with, with Pokemon all over the world. I. I heard about you, Shadden. Oh, God. Okay, never mind. I, I was hoping that you would be nice, Shadden, and that we can be friends. Oh, this is silly, isn't it? I. Just met you, Shadden. <laughs> oh no, I forgot. I was supposed to go help Dad catch my Pokemon. Shadden, I catch you later. Well, I'm not a Pokemon. I catch you later. I'm baby, baby, you know what I mean. Okay. Anyway, woo! This is our Pokemon journey. Um, let's go see. Let's go speak to him. If you use a PC, you can store items in Pokemon. The power of science is staggering. Yes, it is. Power of science. Professor Bird spin up. Spend his days in Pokemon life studying. Then to suddenly go out into the wild and more. Wait, what? Then put. Wait, what? Forget it. I don't. I don't want to check that. I was gonna so. I was gonna see if you walk some tall grass. Go get some Pokemon. I'm um, high. There are scary Pokemon outside. I can hear their cries. I don't want to go see what's going on, but I don't have any Pokemon. Can you go see what's happening for me? Sure, little girl. <laughs> Help me. Uh, uh, that was a boy. That sound like the girliest scream ever. Hello, you over there? Please help. In my bag, there's a Pokeball. Okay. Okay. So why do you choose that starter? Wood. Chicken Pokemon. Professor Bench is in trouble. Release a Pokemon and rescue him. Chick Pokemon. Torch it. Okay. And Mudkip. I really want to go with Street Go because I, cause I usually don't pick grass types. But then I want to choose Torch it because fire types get really strong in the future. But then I want to choose Mudkip because, you know, it's my favorite water type Pokemon. But then again, this one will be bulky as heck. This will be strong. This will be like more like kind of like a defense. Kind of both, really. So I'll go with Mudkip. So you choose this Pokemon? Yes, I do. Oh, why was that Scoot a port? <laughs> a port? Go Mudkip. Okay, anyway, we pretty much, uh, like, literally win this battle anyway. Now that we have our first Pokemon, well, it's not our first Pokemon. It's not our first Pokemon, it's his Pokemon. So I can't say this is really my first Pokemon yet. I don't know what happened to the story. I literally never played this game. I mean, I tried to attempt, I played like a little bit of it. I never really got far like at all. Like just like, like I never even got one bad in this game. Woo! <laughs> I was tall grass setting why Pokemon and why jumped. Oh, you saved me. Hi, you're Shadden. <laughs> this is not a place to chat, so come my Pokemon lab later, okay? So Shadden, I've heard so much about you from your father. I heard that you don't have your own Pokemon yet. By the way, <laughs> the way you battled earlier, you pulled it off with a bloom. I guess you have your father's blood in your veins after all. Oh, yeah. Oh, yes. As thanks for rescuing me, I like you to have Pokemon you used earlier. Shannon, received the Mudkip. Now it's our Pokemon. <laughs> Why you read it? Why not give a nickname to that Mudkip? I named it Muddy, just because it sounds really cute. Muddy! Anyway, let's go name it Muddy, so... M... Uh, no, not M-M. Where's, where's you? Okay. M... U... D... D... R. Now I'm playing. Why? Muddy! So now we have Muddy the Mud Kid. If wait wait wait, if you work at a Pokemon and get experience, I think I, I think you'll make an extremely good Pokemon trainer. And my kid May is also studying Pokemon while helping me out. Shane, don't you think it might be good at least to go to go see May? Sure, why not? Great, maybe maybe happy too. Get May to teach you what it means to be a trainer. What do you mean? I am already the ultimate trainer. Thanks for watching. This was just a oh, little town. This was just the prologue to the actual game that we're gonna start playing this is not episode one it's just the prologue so basically episode zero if that makes any sense thanks for watching don't forget to like comment and subscribe and well have a good one Bye.